Hey guys, Danny Childress here. Hope you guys are doing well. Um, well, happy Veterans Day uh, to some of you guys. I want to I say it's just that God is our great butler. He is our strength. He's in control. And that um, he's your fortress today. It don't matter what is going on in this world. The big picture, we got to remember, we do win in the end. However, whatever's going on, we can still have peace where there isn't. Um, God's made us clear, made it clear that we are still to be salt in this earth. No matter what goes on, guys, I'm going to tell you, have hope in your heart. He loves you today, and he's never given up. He's never going to give up. He's never given up yesterday. You know, he's the great God of salvation. And um, you are under his wing today. He's, think, he's thought about you before the world began. He's loved you ever since. He knew who you were, you know. Um, it's, a, it's a real big deal to think about that. It, it, it's kind of overwhelming, actually, if you think about it. And it's not like the Calvinists say, okay. You were predestinated, but it, because he knew you would believe, you are the one that believed. God did not, he gives you volition to believe and to trust on the Savior, the Lord Jesus Christ, the true living Savior who liveth right now. You know, the law was not enough to save anyone, but he was the end of the law. When he was nailed to the cross, man, we're under grace now. Thank God, right? Thank God we are under grace. But he loves you today. And, man, guys, keep your heads up. Don't worry about all that's going on in this world. Uh, stay in the word of God. And uh, understand he is in control. You know, we're, this is not a, a big deal that, you know, he said this time might come. And hopefully Trump will get it. I'm hoping he will, you know, personally, but with all the counting going on, but you know how this thing goes, you know, at the end, it, the devil's going to get his, he's going to get his shot, okay? He's going to get his shot at this thing to think he can make it a utopian and do it better than God could ever do it, at least to deceive men, to bring, because he hates God so much, to uh, deceive men. To draw their eyes away from God, to blind their eyes, lest they should believe. But you believe, and you know what? Be be happy today. You are a child of God. If you believe on the Lord Jesus Christ, you have eternal life. You need to let your light shine, man. Just like I do. I need to work on it. We all do. But God loves you dearly today, friend. Don't give up. Okay. Hold fast to the faith. This once delivered to not only the first ones that heard it, but also to us in the latter times of the last days, that we might hold on and be holding fast to that which is true. It's a very powerful thing. If you're living in this time right now, which you are, if you're hearing this, God is is giving you a really great gift. I mean, you can feel, I can feel the darkness around me. I don't know about you. I can feel it around me. But if you let it get to you, it will. But man, greater is he that is in you than he that is in the world. I love you guys, man. Y'all stay strong. Pray for me. I'm praying for you too. Man, we need each other. It's almost say we need each other right now. And um, no one's an island. And, and. Unfortunately, we don't have many churches we can go to to get that um, kind of thing. Um, where I live, I don't have much of a church. I mean, I got one down the road. I'm thinking about going to go visit some of them, but to, like, be there to get fed. You know, when you have to work for salvation, they ain't, you're not getting really a good church, possibly, you know. So I can't go for that. I can't buy into that, but I believe we're in the, uh, we're, we've been given grace and we should grow by grace. That's the only way we can grow. But I love you guys. God bless you. All right. 
Amen, amen.